Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to Let's Play Car Mechanic Simulator 2000 and something. I forgot, 2024? Probably. This is the future. The future. I have no money. I have $322. I have some stuff in my inventory. Never mind. I have nothing in my inventory. I, I, I just straight up lie to you. I could always sell this beauty, but I want to repair it. So selling this makes no sense. Meaning I'm going to have to get a car that I can repair, which I can't really. So I'm, I'm in a little bit of a pickle. I could always sell this. We're getting a restoration bonus of 1,800 and have a whole whopping of 20,000. So we're kind of plus minus null, I feel, at this point. Um, we, we, we are a little bit ruined. A little bit ruined. One good thing would be to take off pieces of this car and whatever I can't repair uh, is going to give us some money. How about I sell, I just, I'm just going to sell those rims. I don't, I don't care what the state is. They're, they're, they gon, they gon' be sold. Let's take, let's take them off. Make some cash monies on, on the other car, Bob. Because I don't want those ugly rims. I want, I want some really nice rims. If anything. And I'm not going to be able to repair them. And maybe I can sell some body parts. Just, you know, temporary. I mean, I see enough stuff that's laying around that I could just sell for some money. Can I just give this car to a pawn shop? That'd be great, wouldn't it? That, that'd be fantastic. All right. Wait, I did have stuff in my inventory. Oh, I have plenty of stuff in my inventory. Lies. Lies everywhere. Cool. I have $539. That's not a whole lot. Weasel, that's, it's not a whole lot. It's not a whole lot. I, I, I brought myself into a pickle by just selling stuff. And yeah, I, I ruined myself financially. Okay, let's see if we can take a job real quick. Make some extra cash money. Repair all running gear faults, brake problems. I won't, I need somewhere where I can, um, what do you call it? Uh, paint the car. Something easy like replace brakes and get some paint on there. I've, I've been doing this over and over again. Paint it with the factory color. I can take the job. I'm not going to get the completionist, but at least I'm going to get some money for painting it, which is good enough for me. I'll, I'll roll with that. Yeah, this definitely needs a job. Um, a paint job. Uh, paint job. Paint job in the paint shop. And hopefully we can, can sell a little bit. Factory color, paint. Yes, apply. Nail it back to garage. Wow, is the... I did such a good job painting this. Look at it. I painted it so badly that the rust is still there. Straight up still there. All right. Finished job. I made $250 on this car. Screw you. I don't want to repair the rest. And I just sprayed over your rust. Uh, this I am going to decline. Sorry. I'm not interested in your car. This one. Repair all gearbox. Feels loose. Tapping sounds from the engine. There's a little tap dancer in there. That, that, that is how I answer or answer the phone. It's very reasonable. There's a tap dancer in your car. You should you should check it out, man. I'm so rude. Sloppy car steering fine and run. You know what? Sure. Gear problems. I'll try to fix as much of it as I can from this end. Oh wait a second. Oh no! To reach this, I need to lift this on a lifter, which I can't do. Okay. Stutter, stutter, stutter. This thing here. This thing here. Okay this thing part not discovered that's that's a lot of stuff that's ruined i'm pretty sure we're gonna be able to see everything once i look there oh yeah look at all the things that i can't reach because it needs to be on a lifter ah well ah well i guess something is going to the garage this thing but first i'm basically going to take off all the stuff here that i can sell uh, and then i'm putting the half done car into the garage just a husk yeah just yeah, that's that's good enough. Just basically anything that's also on the um, brake pads. Just, just just a little bit, a few extra dollars that are gonna help us. Right now, it's about every single dollar that I can get my filthy little weasel paws on, and probably also like you know the um, mufflers and such, like the exhaust that all seems like stuff that I could sell for for money. For what else, Weasel? For, for what else? Oh, look at that. That is a nice looking brake shoe you got there. Would be a shame if something happened to that, like me selling it. Well, obviously that is going to happen. Ooh, rear shock absorbers. Let's sell those as well. Because I, I, I'm pretty sure I can't repair those. I guess you could always try, but... One good thing is I can try to repair them and then hopefully make some money on that. Then again, I don't remember which ones were the broken ones. 
Okay, good enough. Just keep the stuff of 100% and we'll be fine. Or, yeah, 90%. Alright, good enough. 1,100. I'll take it. Thank you very much. Ooh, front exhaust pipe. I'll have that. Thank you. That is so nice of you. And can I take the fuel? No. Can cannot. Take out all the pieces. And I don't think I can repair any of those. I'm still trying desperately. Oh, I can repair the fuel. Never mind. I can't repair the fuel pump. I made it even worse. Okay, you're going to the garage now, my friend. Even though there are the part. Oh, man, those doors. <sighs> you're so ruined. Ruined, I tell you. Okay, this one. Move vehicle into the garage. I guess I could also put it into the paint shop, right? No, I can't. Uh, same with the dyno. I guess the only place to put it is in parking. Really? You cannot move it into parking without its wheels? Oh, that's awful. Oh, that's awful. I thought I could maybe store it. But I can't, meaning I can't repair your car. I'm so sorry, sir. Because I have those two things. Because I, I'm awful like that. I want to repair this one, but it's still worth 12000 Still worth 12000 I kind of feel like I'm missing out if I sell this, but... Well... You go away. Go away. Go go away. Finish job. Yeah, it's fine. I repaired it. Don't worry about it. I I, I repaired it. Don't do do not fret. This is all fine. We're gonna take out all the things. Everything. And we're gonna sell it for money. This is an interesting layout that this car has. Definitely definitely unique. And here's the thing. I'm going to try to repair them, and then I'm still going to sell them. Like the awful person I am. Obviously not now, because I still want to ah, put as many repaired parts into the other car. I would save more, though, if I kept them for later. I guess we can always sell the stuff that we can't use later on. Anything that's not 100%, I'm not interested in. That's basically it. All right. Quick look. Does anyone know if I can get a car over 1,000 horsepower? Wow, we got 993. Well, you just gotta keep trying. Wow, that I'm, I'm really lucky repairing this stuff. Wow, that, that went really well. You know, I wonder if I, if I take pieces of this car, if I can just use them on the other car. It's like, oh yeah, you we got several of those pieces. Now thinking about that, look at like the front, the sway bars and whatnot. We can probably use them in plenty of other cars. Since the parts are so interchangeable. Like, yeah, something like a dual wishbone absorber, you can't use on the other car. But what if I just, you know, take this thing apart too. And just see how many parts I can use in the other car. I think that's actually a really, really uh, nice idea. Basically just get a beater and then try to repair them. That does make a whole lot of sense, doesn't it? For example, yeah, front suspension crossmember. I'm pretty sure that would be the same at the other car as well. So that is my genius, ingenious plan now. Ingenious, genius, genius, penis. I don't know. Your toast is well itself to the hot pocket papers. Oh, classic, classic. And I think I've spent like the first half year living in the U.S. eating hot pockets in the evening. Hot pockets are not a thing. We, I mean, maybe they're sold somewhere in Germany. I haven't seen them before. And they're so nice and convenient and tasty with all their non-nutritious things in them. So yeah, e eaten a lot of those. All right, good enough. Did I get everything? All right, there's more. There is more to be had. Take that oil filter. Eh. Uh, can't access this. Maybe not take the engine just yet, because I I assembled most of the engine over there. So it, I don't think it makes sense. Oh, yeah, this is also a completely different engine. I don't think we're going to get anything from this. Um, oh, wait, actually, the brake servo, though, 64%, that's the start. I think we put a battery in. I think we did that before. I think we did that before. Okay, quick look. Repair everything! Pretty sure a few things broke. Did I break the servo, the brake servo? Yes, I did. I sadly did. You're not 100%. I'm not interested. Okay, back to this car. We have 1,700 and a few other pieces, I think. All right, oil filter I-4. Come on, don't, don't, don't be like this. Oil filter I-4. In you go. 
Then front drive axle C. I definitely did not get that from um, my other car. Two of those, please. Thank you. Please and thank you. Oh, yeah, right. Rims. Oh, yeah. We fixed those. Look at that. First rim there. First side done. That's exciting. We, I mean, we're not too far away from uh, finishing it up. And then we should get a nice big restoration bonus, allowing us plenty of uh, play money. Uh, wait, what? Did I select the wrong thing? Oh, I can't do this because I need to put the timing belt in first. Really? No. I must be missing something else here. kind of feel I should be able to take that out before all of this. I might be wrong. I might be wrong. Let's lift it down. Put that friggin' belt back in and then we're good. Dude, hot pockets are gross. Ramen noodles all the way. Why not both? Why why do you have to be so discriminatory against the good ramen noodle uh, the good hot pockets? I mean ramen noodles are sweet. I've lived on those a while too. Mostly in Germany. There's like a brand of ramen noodles that I really like. I couldn't find them here yet, which is really discouraging. Anyway, assemble mode. Serpentine belt A. Belt A. Where are you? There. And on you go. Anything else? No, I think we got it on the side. So now we lift it back up and put the rim on. Please. Hopefully. I, I really hope so. And nope. Wait, what am I missing? I'm, I, oh, there it is. I'm, I'm just blind. The tie rods. I forgot the tie rods. Zubby is committing crimes against the pun people. Well, that's uh, that's uh, a um, I got nothing. I got nothing. I, I wanted to make a pun with the word pun. I mean, maybe she's just punishing you. OMG, what if hot pockets with ramen noodles inside them? But what if was? I don't know if this is gonna work because ramen noodles kind of need to be like wet. And hot pockets aren't necessarily wet, but I, you know what? I mean, I think you're onto something. I think you're onto something. Cram chef bearing cap. Oh, I don't have any left. Oh, I, I guess not. Guess I'm gonna get two. Cram. Oh, never mind. I don't think I have uh, enough money to fix this car up. It w I mean, it was worth a try, but I think I need to still get the gearbox and the shafts and so much stuff from the back. Oil pan I four. Oil pan I4, where are you? Yeah, it's a hundred dollars. That's that's not too bad. Still means we got thirteen hundred left to as play money. That means the front is done, right? I don't think there's anything. Ah, never mind. There is the starter that we need to put in. Let's let's lift it down. All right. Let's see how much I. Ha I mean, I, I have a few things. I have a few things. This might do enough. That is might be enough. Oh, I forgot to put the rubber bushings in. But for now, we need the starter, which is hiding over there. And I have one. Nice. Didn't even have to buy one. It's the little wins that I'm going to be taking home tonight. I'm going to lay in my bed and be like, oh, man, that was so awesome that I was able to repair that starter. I mean, that's the, that's, that's the stuff I think about when I sleep. Not 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 kidding you. I'm, that's, that's, that's what I dream about. Wait. Where? Ah, there's one missing. Okay. I thought I saw that. Cool. How much, how much restoration bonus? Eh, still only 2,000. Could could be a little bit more. Maybe it's not... Rear suspension cross member. Sure. Rear suspension cross member. Rear suspension cross member. 300. Ugh, a grand left. Okay, not, the, the, the hubs and whatnot we got from the other car, so we're saving some money here. So this is clearly working out. Brake discs, pads, and calipers. What could you want more? Wait, come on. Uh, rear suspension upper arm. Uh, this is going to get close, but it might just be enough. It might just be enough. All right. Uh, spring caps. Those I have. Rear spring. Damn it. I mean, a rear spring can't be too expensive, right? Eh, 65. That's acceptable. And the rear shock absorber cap. I can't. I can't. Two of those. It adds up. The little things definitely add up. Classic. Uh, a or B? A. Rear shock absorber A. 
look pretty identical to me. But that's... That's basically what car repair is. Everything freaking looks identical to me, but it's not. And that's why I can't. I, I just... I, I, rear sway bar. Hey, there's so many rear parts. I don't even have to type that in all the time, which is nice. I think that's, to me, the most annoying part is always the, like, looking back and forth what I need and then going back in. Wish there was a nice system that would just list them and you could just, you know... Still have to buy them, but whatever. Sway bar front handling, where is it? It's there. Pretty sure I'll need to. Ooh, this side is nearly done. Wheel hub cab. Hub. Wheel hub cab. There we go. Okay, we, we're gonna need another uh, classic rim. Rim two. Oh, we're gonna be so close, but we're not gonna have enough. Half of this stuff is still missing, and we don't have a fuel tank. No. But I do have some extra parts, which I would probably prefer to keep. All right, fuel pump that we repaired. We have another housing. We have $125 left. Oh, no. Oh, no. So close yet so far. So close yet so far. I think I'm going to need another five, six hundred dollars or so. That would be my best bet. But then we have 100% on everything. And that's a big deal. Oh, small robot bushing. There's only one small thing if you look for it. A single thing. Okay, rear wheel hub. I don't have any of on this car, right? <laughs> and I can't steal it from another car, which is a bummer. Uh, what about if I... Ah, uh, can't be, it can't be moved into the center. Okay. Well, already 4,000 restoration bonus. That's neat. And this is the only stuff we're missing. Only stuff. Rim Classic 2. <sighs> Alright. Hey, you. Is there something I can sell from you that might be worth enough? Maybe. I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm gladly taking this apart and selling all the old parts in the hope I get, you know, another $100, $200. Which is not going to be enough. So my best bet is... Let, let, let's be real here. My best bet is get another car in here that I can repair without having it on a lifter. Um, it's the best. S -s cars loud brake problems. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. This one. I can uh, paint a car in a stock colors. And body panels can be repaired. Do not... Oh, shit. I can't. Oh, no. I don't even have enough money to paint the car. Oh, no. <laughs> uh... Oh no, it's awful. Oh, every, everything is awful. Oh. You know what though? There's broken body parts and I clearly can repair those. And if I can repair those, I'm a happy camper. If I can't repair those, I'm if I even break them further, I'm going to have a lot of problems. Rear bumper, give me. Okay, I think we're good. Did I get the front lights? No, right headlight. Left headlight. Okay, let's repair. And see if we can make some money based on that. Yep, bring it all up. And does the front bumper need to be repaired? Repair body parts. Uh, come on. Please let me make some money on this. Repair damage body parts. Front bumper. Needs to be above 85%. Let's see. Front bumper. Rear bumper. Did I repair it at least once? Yes, I did. Okay, 88%. That's, I think, enough. Quick look, if I'm correct. Uh, yep. Alright. At least we're gonna make some money repairing those parts. And then we can take the next job where we can paint it, because I don't <laughs> have enough money to paint anything here. Which is rather silly. I'm gonna say that's, that's uh, rather silly. Why can't I not take a loan? The loan system is so silly. I'm willing to pay, pay all the interest. I definitely overestimated myself buying two cars there. Given that I have a third car in the garage, that's m most problem here. Total earned 1,000. Money spent on the job. 1,000. What? I did not spend $1,000. I just... Yeah. Yeah, I made, I made a grand on this. Nice. Very, very nice. Body parts all the way to go. Brake problems. Sprayed in factory color. Now I can take this job. Um, and the Cobra. Yeah, you know what? I'm, I'm going to take the job on the Cobra. Repair those pieces. Make some extra money. And then finish up the other car. Because we're close to it. I just want to have a little bit more than a thousand. 
All right, let's see. What what need what needs repairing? Body parts. All the things. They're all ruined. All straight up ruined. This whole car's ruined. What did you do to this poor thing? Why would you treat your car so bad? Ooh, 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 jeez. I'm I'm not gonna touch that. That's that's an expensive job. It's a cool looking car though. Especially after I just assemble it. It's even cooler because it's even faster. With all of that weight missing. Okay, I think we're good. Do I need to repair the body on this though? Uh nope, the body in general doesn't need to be repaired. I think it's in good shape. Cool, I broke two pieces that I probably can't afford. Whatevs! Uh, what parts did I- oh, right taillight and the left fender. That's okay. Uh, body part shop, Cobra. Uh, left taillight and front right fender, I think it was. Don't let me lie. Uh, front right fender. Oh. Okay, never mind, that's not it. Oh, I had a front right fender. Good, good, just making sure I have to buy a front left fender. Nearly spent front left fender. Some uh, money on that that I shouldn't have. There should be a return policy, honestly. That that would help this game out quite a bit, I feel. You know, if you buy, oh. Oh, did I buy the wrong one? Uh, maybe, I don't know. Still gonna make some money on that. I'm happy that I have that repair tool. That helps me making some cash monies. Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Are we good? Let's bring it back. And I have 2,700 now. Yay! Oh, I could have also painted it, but I forgot. All right, let's repair you. It's about damn time. Rear wheel hub. Rear wheel hub. Oh, that's under car part shops. Rear wheel hub. I like how Weasel doesn't even care that this chat is having a pun revolution. Oh, I care. But, you know, you, you can't stand in the way of actual revolution, I mean. We're, we're, we're gonna see what happens. I'm, I'm not fully aware what this revolution is about, but... I'm pretty sure you have serious reasons. You, you have definitely serious concerns that need to be taken serious. Um... Rims. Wheel shop. Rim classic. Yay! It would be nice if you also have to put the tire on. That would be a nice addition to the next car mechanic sim uh, that they're working on, which is really exciting to me. A rear suspension arm A. Rear, oop, rear suspension arm A. Where are you hiding from me? That's the rear sway bar. There it is. Oh, so close. Oh, wait. So close, it's palpable. Which, by the way, I really like. It's a nice word. Rear suspension upper arm. I don't know why. I feel like I know that palpable has nothing to do with with pulp. I just like like pulp, palpable. It's, it's, it has has a nice feel to the book. Like it's nice. Palpable puns. Rubber bushings on there. You go. Did we do it, guys? Did we do it? No, there's some parts are still missing. Uh, this is, for example, the rear shock suspension arm B. Rear shock suspension arm B. Where? Which one? Rear shock. Wait, this is just. It's called, just oh, it's just rear suspension arm B. I'm lying. There's no suspension shock arm. I think it's two that I need. Yep, I needed two. Nearly missed that one. Guys, did we do it? Wait, there's still some bushing missing. A bigger or a small one? Ah, a big one. Mimi Big Boy. Mimi Big Mechanic. Alright, I think. Yay! Guys! Look at that! I get a 10,000 restoration bonus for bringing this to 100%. 100%, yeah! Well, finally sold. Wasn't the last episode, but it was this one, so that's, that's a good thing. I'm craving pizza flavored ramen, if that's even a thing. That does sound really nice. That does sound actually nice. I, I don't know why. Anyway. Sell you. You're, you're getting sell. Wait, how? Where? There. Uh, sell car. Actually, we should probably drive it, shouldn't we? Given that, uh, put it on the dyno, see how fast it is, then drive it, and then sell it. Because, you know, we worked so hard on it. I feel we deserve a test drive. I feel we deserve a test drive. Alright. Uh, put you in the dyno. Oh, no oil in the engine. My bad. Forgot that. 
I would have been just like, if I was repairing that car actually, I'd be like, yeah, whatever, just drive it, it's fine, and then screw the engine, I would have to repair that again. That'd be an interesting mechanic. I do think there is a realistic mode to this game, where it doesn't tell you certain things. I forgot. Some, somebody tell me what the realistic mode was about. There's two different difficulty modes. This is the normal one. You can definitely have it more difficult and more realistic, and I think it has to do with, uh, you never get told what the parts are. Like, like, just, oh, I have these problems, and you have to figure it out, and it, I don't even I think it shows it on a list. Anyway, Dino, there you go. Let's see how fast you are or how slow. Test run. That's a little underwhelming. 143, that's, that's a little, um, meh, I gotta say. It's a, it's, it's, a little, it's a little meh, but what can you do? And I think... Let's let's do a test drive with a completely 100% repaired car, even though it takes forever. <laughs> Fuck Central, that is a really good one. My sister bet that I couldn't build a car out of spaghetti. You'd have seen her face when I drove pasta. <sighs> it's, I I like this one. That 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 one is beautiful. The the good thing is it's also like n there, there's nothing offensive about this joke whatsoever. It's just it just works really well. All right, let's see. Doesn't, doesn't doesn't sound very exciting, but so be it. Yay! Well, it handles well. You got you got to give it that. Hundred percent car. Some 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 sliding around. Yay! Oops! Out and broken. Got to do it all again. That would be horrible if that if it happens to your own cars, like not with customer cars. But, with your own? Good enough! I also just realized there's like nothing about the handbrake in this. Hmm. Alright, <laughs> exam report. Everything is good with this thing that you just completely repaired. Alright, so let's sell this bad boy. Mmm, sweet, sweet money. Well, so far I have the husk of another car, 33,000. And I want to fix this one up. Um, to the best of my abilities in the next episode and then see how much we got with this and then I have plenty of money to go to an auction and build any car that I want Fantastic. Thanks so much for watching. If you enjoyed this episode of Car Mechanic Simulator, make sure to hit that like button Thanks so much Chad, for being here. I'm Weasel. I'm out and I hope to see you around. Bye-bye